Hey everybody, Keith Dotson here, and in this video, we're in Lincoln County, New Mexico, which is famous as the home territory of the Old West outlaw, Billy the Kid. There are a lot of Billy the Kid historical sites around here, and in fact, here's one now. Nearby this marker was the Great House Inn and Tavern, where one of his most notorious shootouts happened. He slept here with some of his gang, and when he woke up, the tavern had been surrounded by a posse from nearby White Oaks. The posse called for Billy to come out, and... Billy said, well, why don't you come in instead? As a compromise, they each sent one man over. After many hours of negotiations going nowhere, the posse got restless and a shot was fired outside. Now the man inside naturally assumed the posse had shot Billy's man, which meant that he would soon be dead himself. So he crashed out of the tavern through the window where he was killed in a hail of gunfire. Billy blamed the posse for shooting too hastily, thinking that it was him coming out the window, and the posse claimed that Billy shot the man in the back. No one knows for sure. White Oaks is our destination for this video. I have to say I was a little disappointed when arriving there, though. It's billed as a ghost town, which is decidedly not a ghost town. People still live there, and I expected many more abandoned places than I found there. On the way into town, I stopped at this Old West Cemetery to take a look around. It says White Oaks was a gold mining town starting in 1869. That posse was chasing Billy the Kid because he had been stealing horses from here. This was originally a store built in 1895. Over the years, it's also been a school and a dance hall. This was the White Oak School, also built in 1895, and it closed in 1947. Now it's somewhat of a museum. That sign says this safe was held in the White Oaks Post Office and that it was blown open and robbed in the early 1920s.
I can never resist rusty old classic cars. I actually shot the photographs of these before I made the video so I could avoid getting footprints in my shots. This one's been used for target practice. Look at all those bullet holes. Thanks for watching, everybody. Be sure to visit my website at keithdotson.com.